What's up guys, Kiwis here and welcome back to another video. As always, thank you for being here and choosing to click on a video. Um, as you can tell by the total today, we've got one of the 5 times 85 plus rated player packs. And we've also got the 25 uh, times 83 plus player packs as well. Um, in the background right now, there's just 10 UCL packs. I've sped them up um, because we don't want the video ridiculously long. You can tell by the follower thing popping up on the screen that um, I was streaming during them. Um, the 10 UCL packs and the 2583 plus packs were on Datlux's account. Um, we've opened many packs on his account before and uploaded them. I know uh, the 585 plus is on my account. Um, I will be doing the 2583 plus on my account as well. But um, I've only done the online tokens. I've not done the squad battle ones yet. They'll probably be done Monday. So I'm hoping to upload that, uh, open them on stream Monday night. So hopefully upload them for a video Tuesday sometime. But yeah, I've seen a few on Twitter. And people have told me about them in the Twitch stream. And they look very OP at the minute. Um, yeah, if people are wondering what my thoughts on the icon swaps are. I was going to do the mid slash prime icon pack for 15. And then the 585 pluses for free. Because you get 18 overall. There's 17 highest ticket uh, tokens. But you do get 18. But I don't want to grind all the way to 15 tickets. To pack like a middle Berezi or somebody. So I've changed my mind. So I'm going to get more packs for more content. And I'm going to get an icon pack as well. I'm going to get the two ultimate packs. I'm going to get the 2583 pluses. The 585 pluses. And a base icon pack. All of them does add up to 18 tokens. Which... Is how many you get. So I can't afford to miss any. But with them being friendlies. It's actually been brilliant this year. Pretty much everybody's quitting at 1-0. Um, so yeah. That's been really good so far. Um, I completed like four of them. In about an hour and a half. Two hours. The Premier League one. I've done in about 15 minutes. So yeah. That was really good. Uh, that being said. 25 rare players pack. 83 plus is guaranteed. I say this is on Lux's account. I will be doing on my account Monday night, hopefully. But walkout, you'd expect it to be a walkout. You'd like to think so anyway. That being said, we see French flag. Think who could it be? Striker. That's right. He gets Mbappe. Like ridiculous. Mbappe is sick. Probably the best non-icon player on this entire game. CR7 could be considered, but I'd probably say Mbappe's better just because he's a lot better on the ball than CR7. So. What's ridiculous already is obviously this is Lux's account. He's already got an untradeable CR7 UCL card. And I'm pretty sure he had an untradeable UCL Mbappe. That for some godforsaken reason he put into an SVC. So this guy is lucky enough to pack two untradeable Mbappes now on his one account. Which is insane. As I say along with a CR7 pack pulled as well is just ridiculous pack luck. Um, but yeah like as you can see if these packs are worth it. He gets an Mbappe, an Allison, a Neuer, an Edison, a Miller, De Gea. So he gets six walkout players. One of which goes for 850k on Xbox. You can see a load of 85s in there as well. I 100% think this pack is worth taking. As I say, I was going to do the middle slash prime icon, but I've changed my mind completely after seeing these packs, and I want to get this pack. I'm going to open it straight away, as I say, on Monday, hopefully, on the main account. I am actually going to do it on the Road to Glory, and I'm going to save it until Team of the Year, because this pack could be monstrous on Team of the Year. My main account, I'm not a fan of saving packs, but on the Road to Glory that I don't play a lot, very rarely, I'm going to save it for Team of the Year and see if you can pack something monstrous from it. But yeah, Mbappe in this is absolutely incredible. Um, I've seen so many people open them on Twitter, getting Neymar's, Mbappe's, freezes, insane. As you see, 5, 85 plus rare player. This is on my account, so obviously I'm hoping for something big. We get a walkout, which is obviously nice. Some people haven't and got 5, 85s. It's a freeze card. It's Italian, it's left mid, and it's actually one of the best ones that you can get. I didn't know what to think of it straight away, honestly, because Verratti in FIFA has never been good. But I looked at his in-game stats, and he actually looks really good. Apologies for the follows that are about to come on the screen. There's only two, but because I'm streaming, um, I don't get many follows. So um, I tend not to just forget to turn them on. But yeah, I look at a card, and I think, that's okay. Decent pace, decent dribbling, okay passing, shooting. It looks good, but 
His in-game stats are actually really good. Biggest problem, he's five foot five. Um, which I've used a couple I've used him a couple of times now by the time this video is released. And yeah, he's he's decent, but five five is a big issue. You literally run near anybody and you get pushed off the ball. But anything else in there? We got to Stegen as well, 385s. I mean, that's not great, but a Variety and a Testagen cannot complain about that whatsoever. Variety goes for over 200k. Testagen's obviously about 50k usually when SBC comes out. And then 385s to stock in the club. But, as you can see by the stats, he's 4-star, 4-star, brilliant. High-medium, brilliant as a forward player. His defensive and physical is not good enough to play him with a CDM with this card. But, brilliant acceleration, insane attack positioning. Finishing's decent, shot power's quite low, which is a bit of an issue, but insane agility, insane balance, insane dribbling, very good composure as well. Um, ball control's good, stamina's decent. Like, that card looks really good as, like, a lamb or a ram. Um, 85 finishing and 83 sprint speed might let him down a lot as an actual cam, but as a wide player with them agility and balance stats with insane acceleration, could be a really good card. So, yeah. I'd say, only one pack was my account, but I thought you guys would like the content and see what the pack look is like, um, which is ridiculous. But yeah, that being said, really appreciate you all uh, watching the video. Let me know if you've packed anything good. Hopefully you have. Uh, good luck if you are opening packs. That being said, thank you for watching. That's going to be, uh, if you haven't already, left a like or commented on the video, then that would be appreciated. That's going to be the end of the video for me, guys. Thank you for watching.